What's up, fuckers? My name is Alexander Hamilton. Welcome to my channel and welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. Um, once again, recording this immediately after the last video. Future me is going to be very pissed off about this, but fres but present me does not give a flying fuck. Speaking of future and present, <laughs> that got a little uh, like. Like, um, messed up last time. Yeah, last time we had some, uh, wibbly-wobbly, timey-wimey shenanigans. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna go talk to Bull. More healing for you, oh, wait. Wrong way. Thank you. <laughs> there he is. Hey, buddy. They've got good form. Cullen's putting his Templar training to good use. Hmm. How'd you know he's a Templar? Did Cullen tell you he was a Templar? He's not wearing the armor. He didn't have to. Might not be a Templar shield, but it's a Templar holding it. He angles the shield just a bit down. Helps direct fire or acid away, so it doesn't spray right into your face. Hmm. Kalari learned the same thing when we trained to fight to Vinter Mages. No Templar's doing good work. Hmm. Yes, he is. You could always help. I'd rather discuss your men. I'd rather discuss your Are men. Are your mercenaries adjusting to life here? Getting there. No major fights with Inquisition troops. Beyond the usual chest thumping. Don't worry. The Chargers have worked with other groups before. I'll keep them in line. Biggest problem for the Inquisition right now isn't on the front line. It's at the top. You've got no leader. No Inquisitor. Liliana is our leader. Do we need one? Capricentia. Perhaps I should lead. Colin commands the troops. Perhaps I should lead? Then maybe we need one. Slightly approves. I'd be willing. You? Huh. Why you? Someone should. I'm willing. I was chosen by the Maker. I can seal rifts. I've got the mark on my hand. I've sealed Fade rifts. And hopefully I'll seal the Breach as well. That means you have a skill. That doesn't necessarily mean you should be deciding alliances. My people don't pick leaders from the strongest, or the smartest, or even the most talented. We pick the ones willing to make the hard decisions. And live with the consequences. Hmm. Ah, who knows? Maybe you seal the Breach. The Chantry gets off its ass and all those soldiers go home and get fat. Do you think? It could happen. It won't. But it would. Hmm. So Still want to talk to him. That Tevinter guy sent you into the future? Ugh. Hey. Tevinter magic goes too far. It was incredible. Weird, right? I'll protect you. Oh, there's a heart. Go with that. If you're worried about magic, I can protect mm -hmm. you. My blade pretty much protects me. Perhaps I can do things your blade can't. <laughs> it has blood grooves. Well, technically, it's the fuller, but blood grooves sound so much more violent. <laughs> anyway, I hope our new friends have what it takes to close the breach. Damn thing gives me a headache just looking at it. I want to keep on talking to what him. What can I do for you? Investigate. Um, um, tell me of the Ben Hasrath. I'd like to know more about your work with the Ben Hasrath. Ben Hasrath is actually a general term. You've got the secret police who investigate problems inside our territory. You've got the re-educators who take people with problems and fix their minds. Or make them disappear. And then you've got the spies. Like, re-educators? How do the re-educators work? I only know the basics. Wasn't my area. That said, keep a man awake long enough, ask the right questions, give the right potions, and you can get him to say anything. Mm. You don't need blood magic or demons to change someone's mind. We're a lot more fragile than we'd like to believe. Yeah. I've heard rumors. My parents told me stories about what the re-educators did. Yes, you were lucky your parents got away. The weak minds get bent into the right shape. Strong minds like yours. They'd have given you a poison called Kamek. You'd have been a polite, happy laborer for the rest of your life. And you'd have had a handler to help you eat and make sure you didn't crap your pants. None sound like you, your job is spying. None sound like you. None of those sound exactly like you. Yeah, I was a special case. They sent me to Saharan because they needed someone who could fight and hunt down problems. That whole island was a sack of cats. Incursions from Tevinta, Talvashath, and native rebels fighting both sides. And in the middle, me. 
trying to wrangle the rebels and restore order. Sounds difficult, sounds impossible, sounds fun for you. Sounds difficult. I can't imagine that was easy. Nope. I hunted down a lot of rebels. Lost a lot of friends to the Vince, or the Fog Warriors, or the Talvashaw. One day I woke up and couldn't think of a damned reason to keep doing oh, my shit. job. Turn myself into the re-educators. Re-educators? Holy shit. Even knowing what they did, that was brave. That worked out well enough. Even knowing what they did? You'd heard what the re-educators did to their prisoners. Yes, I had. I wanted them to fix me like they fixed them. The Ben Hasrath ordered me to go to Orlay, ostensibly as a Talvashaw, and work undercover. That's how I ended up here. Means I got to meet you. You've had a hard time. Wow, interesting story. Means I got to meet you. I'm glad you're here, Paul. Me too. If you ever need to talk more about all this, let me know. Nah, it was a long time ago. Thanks, though. <laughs> I want to keep talking. What's going on? See, uh, let's talk about being Kinari. A few here who know what it means to be Kinari. You're not Kinari. You're Talvasha. World of difference. I'm proud of it. I'm still different. I wish I'd known the Kuhn. I feel like my character would say I'm proud of it, but I feel like the way to get into his pants would be to say I wish I'd known the Kuhn. Uh, I'm proud of it. My parents raised me to be free. I'm grateful to them. Fine. They're cool. You didn't turn into a murdering bandit, so I guess we're fine. You want to know anything about the Canari? Since we're talking about them. Okay. Investigate. Uh, how do they govern? How do the Canari rule themselves? It's pretty simple. We've got the matriarchy, the priesthood, and the military. The priesthood figures out how Canari should live in theory. The matriarchy makes it work in practice. And the military keeps the Canari safe from outside threats. Is there much dissent? Does it actually work like that? Is there much infighting? Not like you're thinking of. People disagree, yeah, but the priests are there to solve disagreements. Here in Olay, politicking comes from people putting their own gain ahead of the gains of society. If you do that among the Canari, the Ben Hasrath sets you straight. Or kill you. Hmm. What's with Talvashoth? What's your problem with Talvashoth? As Ben Hasrath, my job back home was keeping the peace, helping people live by the Kuhn. Talvashoth turned their back on all that, decided they'd rather live like savages. The Kuhn is not perfect, but at least there's some sense to it. My parents weren't savages. My parents weren't like that. They lived peacefully and raised me as well as any human parents could. Oh, well, good. They aren't the kind of Talvashoth I've got a problem with, then. Can you not Look, make noise while I'm recording, Look, if you're worried Cliff? I'm going to attack you, don't we? I had a lifetime of fighting Talvashoth. You're not the kind I hate. Okay. Investigate. Hmm. Okay. Uh, day-to-day -day life. How is everyday life different for Kanari? Uh, depends on your job, I guess. Some are just about the same. A baker in Val Royo gets up, gets dressed, and starts work. A baker in Parvolin does the same thing. They don't care about the Empire or the Cube. Mostly they worry about breaking eggs and hope the dough rises right. Except that baker isn't free. It can't be exactly the same. The Canari have no personal freedoms. How many personal freedoms do you figure that baker in Val Royo has? Life isn't about freedom. The baker in Parvolin wonders if she'll be given enough eggs to do her work. Will they come on time? Will the kitchen workers get her bread while it's fresh, or will they come late and blame her because it's stale? Same crap in Val Royo. People are just people. Hmm. Okay. How was it growing up? What's it like growing up under the Kuhn? The Tamasrans raise us in these units of kids all our own age. They're like teachers, or... Chantry sisters. They also helped figure out what jobs we should do. They had me pegged for military work early on. When they learned I could hit stuff and lie, they started training me for the Ben Hasra. You must have been proud. So no families? You didn't choose your job? Okay. So the Kuhn decided what work you would do. You didn't get a choice. I could have acted like I didn't like hitting things, I guess. But why would I do that? 
<laughs> I was good at my work. I liked doing it. As far as I can tell, the Tamasrans made the right call. Okay, investigate. What if they just fell to the queue? Do you ever think about what would happen if the Canari conquered Orlay or Ereldon? Some folks, like Cassandra or Cullen, would do fun if they didn't die fighting. Those two love rules. But the mages. Can you imagine Solus trying his fade dreaming under the cube? Or Dorian thinking of someone besides himself? Varric's tall tales would land him in a re-education prison, drugged until his mind broke. So, to answer your question, no, I don't think about it much at all. Okay, do you not marry? I heard there's no marriage among the Canari. Yeah, that's true. Canari love our friends like anyone does, but we don't have sex with them. Hmm. Canari don't have sex? <laughs> oh, we definitely have sex. They're Tamasrans who pop your cork whenever you need it. What, really? Seriously? Yes. It's not a big deal like it is here. It's like, I don't know, going to see a healer. Sometimes it's this long, involved thing. It takes all day. Leaves you walking funny. <laughs> Other times you're in and out in five minutes. Thank you. See you next week. I don't know what to say. That's bizarre. Sounds great. You don't know true passion. So you've never really made love. Connected with someone in both body and soul. I don't know. One time they used this thing called the Sato Nerapan. It's a leather wrapped rod on a harness. That wasn't really my soul. Also, there were more than two people. He likes to get pegged? His sex appeal just tripled. Okay. <clears throat> Pose yourself, Alexander. You're filming right now. What does Kunari mean? Kunari. Does it mean what we are? The race? Or is it anyone who follows <laughs> Why can't I stop smiling? Who you ask. Are you Kunari or Talvashan? The humans and elves who follow the Kune are the Vidathari. Vidathari. The Kunari who break away from the Kune are Talvasha, deserters. And those who predate the Kune? What about Kunari who existed before the Kune? The people we came from. They're called the Kasseth, but we don't use that word for the race. We came south to Thedas because the Kasseth were... I don't know. We had to leave. The stories aren't clear. But I don't expect they look much like us. Whatever they are. Okay. Nice talking to you. See you I'm later, stop smiling. See ya. So, uh, what's up next for main quest thing? What the? You're in battery saver mode. Some features may be limited. Okay. <coughs> Why is my throat so scratchy? Can I help you? Oh, yeah. I missed the dialogue option. Why the name Iron Bull? How did you get the name Iron Bull? I picked it. You know how it is. Even growing up Talvashath, your parents had to tell you about some of it, right? No names. I figure your parents chose yours the same way. Nice going on a dar, by the way. Weapon. I like that. My name is a Korarod. Why that name, though? But why specifically Iron Bull? This may surprise you, but I really like hitting things. <laughs> also, it's you can come and hit this anytime you want. <laughs> I like having an article at the front. It makes it sound like I'm not even a person, just a mindless weapon. An implement of destruction. That really works for me. See you later. Nice talking to you. So, uh, what's up next for a main quest thing? I saw the leader of Bull's charge as that iron bull. He's something, is he not? Oh, go on with you. You can't go making cow eyes at one of those oxmen. No harm in looking, is there? Those shoulders. Those horns. You're mad. Maybe, but I'm not dead. That felt... felt a bit... that statement felt a bit... wrong. Okay, so what do I do now? What's the next step in the main storyline? We got the mages. So what's up next? Join forces with your new allies to assault the heart of the breach and close it once and for all. Recommended for levels, levels 8 to 11. Hmm. What's my current rank? Okay, I'm level 7, so I gotta do a couple of side quests to level up first. What's in here? The Inquisition cannot remain, Ambassador. 
If you can't prove, it was founded on Justinia's orders. This is an inopportune time, Marquis. More of the faithful flock here each day. But allow me to introduce you to the brave soul who risked his life to slow the magic of the bridge. Master Radar, this is the Marquis Durellion, one of Divine Justinia's greatest supporters. And the rightful owner of Haven. How does Durellion lend Justinia these lands for pilgrimage? This Inquisition is not a beneficiary of this arrangement. You own this land? This is the first I've heard of Haven having an owner outside the Chantry. My wife, Lady Machin of Denver, has claimed to Haven by ancient treaty with the monarchs of Ferelden. We were honored to lend its use to Divine Justinia. She is a... She was a woman of supreme merit. I will not let an upstart order remain on her holy grounds. Its followers need shelter. The Divine's advisors founded it. We all have bigger problems. Uh, that one. Interesting. Considering the Inquisition was begun by the left and right hands of the Divine. I see no written records from Sister Liliana or Seeker Pentacus that Justinia approved the Inquisition. If he won't take her at her word, I'm afraid Seeker Pentagas must challenge him to a duel. What? It is a matter of honor among the Navarans. Shall I arrange the bout for tonight? No. No. Perhaps my reaction to the Inquisition's presence... Oh shit, my phone's about to die. Tasty. Can you reach? We face a dark time, your grace. Divine Justinia would not want her passing to divide us. She would, in fact, trust us to forge new alliances to the benefit of all, no matter how strange they might seem. I'll think on it, Lady Montilier. The Inquisition might stay in the meanwhile. Does the Marquis own Haven? Do the Durellians actually have a claim on this place? His Grace's position is not so strong as he presents it. Despite their Ferelden relations, the Durellions are Orlesian. If the Marquis wishes to claim Haven, Empress Selene must negotiate with the Ferelden on his behalf. Her current concerns are a bit larger than minor property disputes. Sorry for interrupting. You handled the Marquis well. Uh, you handled it well. I'm so pleased the Marquis isn't tossing us out into the cold. His grace is only the first of many dignitaries we must contend with. You expect more people in Haven? Undoubtedly. And each visitor will spread the story of the Inquisition after they depart. An ambassador should ensure the tale is as complimentary as possible. Okay, investigate. Uh, one moment, I need to grab my charging cord. My phone's about to die. Hope it still works. My floofster has nearly chewed this thing to pieces. No matter how many times I tell her, don't mess with the cables, that's bad. She just don't listen. Oh, speaking of which, hi, baby. Aw, oh, you're so cute. Okay. How did you become an ambassador? What's your background? How did you become an ambassador? May I ask what brought you to work for the Inquisition? Sister Leliana approached me. We've been acquainted for quite some time. For better or worse, being the Inquisition's diplomat has become as interesting as she promised. Uh, what's your background? What sort of dealings have you had with nobility? For some years, I was the royally appointed court ambassador from Antiva to Orlay. The nobility of Thedas is a rather singular sphere. Those I'm not acquainted with, I know through reputation. Have I'm glad you're here. Having your own kind heard this politics were ridiculous. I'm glad you're here. The Inquisition is lucky to have you as an advocate, Lady Montilier. Thank you. Let us hope so. Thedas's politics have become agitated as of late. I hope to guide us down smoother paths. But please excuse me. I've much work to do before the day is done. Okay, I've been lollygagging for too long. I need to do some side quests to bump up my rank. Gains me XP. You know what? I'm gonna do this off camera. I'm do the, gonna do the side quest off camera, and we'll return when we're ready to get back to the main quest. Okay, I went off and did a bunch of side quests. I am now level eight. Eight. I would have liked to get higher, but um, uh, 
Yeah, a lot of death, a lot of frustration, and I just want to get back to main story shit. Go in peace, Harold of Andraste. Thank you. I needed to hear that. Harolden. Master Dennett's horses are a fine addition to our stables. I will see they are well tended. Yeah, in your heart shall burn. <sighs> Let's do this. The best of the mages are ready, Harold. Be certain you are prepared for the assault on the breach. We cannot know how you will be affected. Let's do this. This can't be the end of the game. No, no way. There's no way this can be the end. Taking Dorian, Varric, and Iron Bull. <sighs> Let's do this. Why am I getting laggy? Okay, we had a lag spike there. Mages! Focus past the Herald. Let his will draw from you. be the end of the game. Achievement unlocked opposition in all things. That can't be the end of the game. There is no way that's the end of the game. That can't possibly be the end. Solus confirms the heavens are scarred but calm. The breach is sealed. We've reports of lingering rifts, and many questions remain. But this was a victory. Word of your heroism has spread. We did all this. It wasn't me, it was the mark. It's too soon to celebrate. We did all this. You know how many were involved. Luck put me at the center. A strange kind of luck. I'm not sure if we need more or less. But you're right. This was a victory of Alliance, one of the few in recent memory. With the breach closed, that Alliance will need new focus. Forces approaching! To arms! What's going on? I knew that couldn't be the end what? of the game. We must get to the gates! a dull moment for southerners, is there? I knew it was too easy. I'll help you. You get to Cullen. What is going on? Cullen? One watch guard reporting. It's a massive force, the bulk over the mountain. Under what banner? None. None? I can't come in unless you open. Who 
are you? I'm Cole. I came to warn you, to help. People are coming to hurt you. You probably already know. What is this? What's going on? The Templars come to kill you. Templars? Is this the Order's response to our talks with the Mages, attacking blindly? The Red Templars went to the Elder One. You know him? He knows you. You took his mages. There. This Elder One. Holy shit. Ugh. He's very angry that you took his mages. Cullen, give me a plan. Anything. Haven is no fortress. If we are to withstand this monster, we must control the battle. Get out there and hit that force. Use everything you can. Mages! You! You have sanctioned to engage them! That is Samson! He will not make it easy! Inquisition! With the Herald! For your lives! For all of us! Holy shit. What, what do I do? Hold on. What is the objective? Haven is under attack and must be defended. Okay. Why do you not attack when I hold the button? Red Templar horror. Ugh, this red lyrium all sticking out of their backs. Oh, that is horrifying. Don't worry, I'll put you out of your misery. I can't see. Oh, shit. Wait. Okay. This thing. Area of effect. Never mind. Almost ready. Keep them off us. Okay, we ready for the next wave? Okay, get ready. One moment. Wait, no, wrong button! Shit. I didn't mean to do that. Let's try some of that! He got out of the way! Someone order a fresh batch of death! Get it while it's hot! Shit, ball. Ah, bitch with a shield. Take some of this! Keep them back! We're ready to fire! Holy shit. Oh, they're coming from this direction. Holy shit, I got the big guy! <sighs> Come on, Bull, you are just a health potion drain. Okay, Varric and Bull. Okay! Okay. We must get this trebuchet firing. 
Yeah, I got I got the gist. We are down to three health potions. Take some of that! I hate these assholes with the shields! Wrong thing. I keep pressing the wrong fucking button. Okay. That. Okay. Take some of this! Oh, I'm low on health. Okay. That packs a serious punch! Shit, bulls, low on health. Okay. Can you all please not die while I do this? Did I just pull a move on? Yep. Bitches oh, must get buried. Take some of that. What the fuck was that? What was that? Is that a fucking oh, dragon? Everyone to the gates. Is that a fucking dragon? Where is he? Hold on. Where are you? Uh, shield back! Shield back! Everybody fall back! Move it! Move it! That is a fucking we dragon! Need back to the chantry. It's the only building that might hold against that beast! At this point, just make them work for it. The villagers will need help in their survivors. Holy shit! Okay, what do I do? Holy shit! Uh, pause. Map. Evacuate Haven by leading his people to the Chantry. Okay, set active. Put a marker there. And let's go! And try not to die! What's wrong? I hear a voice. Shield bash! Door's obstructed. Well, what do I do? No. No. <sighs> Shit. Okay. Don't. Where is it? 
Sheriff. Help! We're losing people. Okay. Shield bash! There we go. Fuck. Oh no, we're out of health potions. What do we do? We're all gonna die. Hey, Varric, where even are you? <sighs> shit, shit, shit. I don't. What to do? I'm very overwhelmed. I'm very overwhelmed. Where we need more healing potions. Where do we get more healing potions? I'm sorry, Varric. Okay, what do I do? I'm sorry, Varric. Shit. I hear a voice. Rescue. Rescue. Flissa. Where is she? I'm sorry, Varric. Okay. Everybody's dying. I hear a voice. Where? <sighs> I'm so overwhelmed. I'm incredibly overwhelmed. Okay. Rescue Menevive. Another dead one. I'm so... Everyone's dying! I'm so overwhelmed, I don't know what to do! Hold on, Bob! What do I... What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Why did I come in here? Supply cash! Okay, I'm gonna load. I'm gonna load. Load game. Okay, we're starting all back from the beginning of this. Now I know what to do. Okay, first things first, I need to get to that supply cache. Why do you go so slow? Hear that? I'm ignoring everyone and everything. I need that supply cash. You hear that? Survivors! I hear it in a moment. Get the supply cash. Okay. We're replenished. Rescue Menevive. Watch out, the flames will reach the box. 
Someone in here? We're losing people. Okay, okay. I'm ignoring enemies. We're just focusing on helping townspeople. Oh, they're not in the same places! They're not in the same places! Oh no, I'm extremely overwhelmed. Okay. Shit, bull. Okay. I'm on my way! Where is everyone? Hell. I'm right here. Shit, Varric. Don't die. Okay. Let me out of here. Okay, okay, uh, I need to heal. What next? What next? Okay, what next? What do? What do? Shit. Okay. Stay calm. Remain calm. Where are people that need help? Where are they? Is there anybody in here? Hey, nobody here. Where are they? Is there anybody else? Did I get everybody? Oh, I just need to come over here. Come on, monsters! Where are the people that need helping? Where are they? Where are they? So confused, stressed, overwhelmed. Save a few, time to go. Regroup at the chantry. Okay, I got everybody. Regroup at the chantry. <sighs> Move. Keep going. The chantry is your shelter. <sighs> he tried to stop a Templar. The blade went deep. He's going to die. What a charming boy. Harold, our position is not good. That dragon stole back any time you might have earned us. I've seen an archdemon. I was in the Fade, but it looked like that. I don't care what it looks like. It's got a path for that army. They'll kill everyone in Haven. The Elder One doesn't care about the village. He only wants the Herald. I give myself to save Haven. Why would does he want, want me? Hmm. I'd give myself to save Haven. If it will save these people, he can have me. It won't. He wants to kill you. No one else matters, but he'll crush them. Kill them anyway. I don't like him. You don't like... Harold. There are no tactics to make this survivable. The only thing that slowed them was the avalanche. We could turn the remaining trebuchets, cause one last slide. We're overrun. To hit the enemy, we'd bury Haven. We're dying, but we can decide how. Many don't get that choice. You look like you know something. Yes. 
Chancellor Roderick can help. He wants to say it before he dies. There is a path. You wouldn't know it unless you'd made the summer pilgrimage, as I have. The people can escape. She must have shown me. Andraste must have shown me so I could t tell you. Cullen, can you get them out? Rox won't stop a dragon. Go, I'll distract him. What do you mean? What are you on about, Roderick? It was whim that I walked the path. I did not mean to start. It was overgrown. Now, with so many in the Conclave dead, to be the only one who remembers. <laughs> I don't know, Harold. If this simple memory can save us, this could be more than mere accident. You could be more. Cullen, can you get them out? Rocks won't stop a dragon. Go, I'll distract him. Cullen, can you get them out? What about it, Cullen? Will it work? Possibly. If he shows us the path. But what of your escape? Perhaps you will surprise it. Find a way. Inquisition, follow Chancellor Roderick through the Chantry. Move! Herald, if you are meant for this, if the Inquisition is meant for this, I pray for you. Nothing like being on the brink of death to bring you to make you stop being an asshole. They'll load the trebuchets. Keep the Elder One's attention until we're above the tree line. So I don't have to kill it, I just if have to keep to its attention. Chance, if you are to have a chance, let that thing hear you. So I just have to distract it. All right, time. Okay, I'm saving. Get loud. Okay, next day, Alex here. Um, I went back. I loaded an old game, did some grinding, got to level eleven, got better armor, a better weapon, and we are ready to try this again. Whoops! Didn't mean to click that. Okay. Let's do this. Die. Why do you not- Why do you sometimes not attack when I hold the button? You know what? Screw it. Just get to the trebuchet. You used two healing potions already? Shit. Wrong direction. I think I know what to do after doing this six fucking times. Solus, don't you dare die. I should have. You know what? Loading. Loading already. I already fucked it up. Okay, let's just go. Okay, kill these bitches. You evil fucks don't even get the honor of being called Bastish. Holy shit. Okay, will you just die already, you fuck? Okay, I got the- You got the big guy. Okay, let's get to the trebuchet. Okay, ignore them. Ignore them and get to the trebuchet. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Wish I had a button for stop fighting those guys and follow me. Okay, also I'm not looting anything because I forgot to empty my inventory. My inventory is completely full. Okay, got to the trebuchet and have all eight potions. Is there actually a time limit on this? Okay, take some of this! Die. Die. Okay, I think you guys got this. Shit, I should've healed. 
Alright, you got this bull. You guys got me covered, right? I'm trusting you. Shit, okay. You need to heal. You need to heal. And I need to heal. Okay. Will you all just die? Shit, Solus. What just happened? That was weird. I think I pressed the wrong button. Die, die, die. Will all of you just die? Solus, can you please stop dying? All the bad guys die and all my guys stop dying. Bull. Oh, he is a real glass cannon, isn't he? Very thin glass cannon. He hits hard, but he really cannot take a hit. Fuck it. You heal, and you heal. I think I'm good. Coming our way. Come on, Solus. We're out of healing potions. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. What do I do? Is there... Is there a supply cache near here? And Solus just died. Oh. There's a supply cache right fucking here. Okay. Where's Solus? Solus? There you are. Get up! We need you! Okay. You heal, and you heal. I got the trebuchet. I hope after today I never have to say the word trebuchet ever again. Damn it. Shit, bull. Watch health bars. Okay, that means... Okay, I need to heal. I think everybody else is good for now. Holy shit! Uh, like, Antivian fire. Kill it with fire! Immune! Of fucking course it's immune! Night Captain... Is this name Denim? You do not die. Okay, thank you, Solus. Thank Solus. Holy shit, I am almost dead. Watch your health bar, Dangus. <coughs> Kinda caught between a rock and a hard place. Shit, shit, shit. I'm down to two health potions. Please tell me that supply cache wasn't one use. It was one use. Fuck. Oh boy. Die. 
die, die, die. Shit, I'm about to die. <laughs> Gotta remember to use my abilities and shit. Ooh, this is a tough one. This is Teppy, this is Teppy, I am about to die. I need to... Ah. Get, let me out! Get out of my way! Shit, 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 please tell me there's another supply crate. Do not die, do not die, do not die. Please tell me there's another supply crate. Please, oh please, oh please, oh please. Shit. The big guy's following me, isn't he? I died. I fucking died. Okay, Solus, you have the most health. You need to come revive me. Okay, I'm back. Oh shit. Ball! Ball, get up! Get up, ball! Shit. Where are they? Where are they? Get off Solus! I am not doing this a seventh fucking time! Where's the- Where are they? Where are- Where is everybody? Shit, 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 shit. Fuck! Why is this so hard? Please, 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 please. Move! Now! Holy shit. She just blow up the fucking trebuchet. Don't turn this into a boss fight. Please don't turn this into a boss fight. Dragon. Enough. Pretender, you toy with forces beyond your ken no more. Why are you doing this? I don't fear your creature, just off so we can talk. I don't fear you, creature! Whatever you are, I'm not afraid. Words mortals often hurl at the darkness. Once they were mine, they are always lies. Know me. Know what you have pretended to be. Exalt the Elder One. The will that is Corypheus. You will kneel. Never! I want to understand you. I will not yield what you want from me. I will not yield! You'll, you'll get nothing out of me. You will resist. You will always resist. It matters not. I am here to anchor. The process of removing it begins now. No! It is your fault, Geralt. You interrupted a ritual years in the planning, and instead of dying, you stole it. I do not know how you survived, but what marks you as touched, what you flail at rifts, 
I crafted to assault the very heaven. No! And you used the anger to undo my work. The gall. The divine died for this. Why I never wanted this. Take it. The divine died for Why this. Why did the divine die? For this chaos. The chaos will empower me and ensure we no longer beg at the feet of the invisible. I once breached the Fade in the name of another to serve the old gods of the Empire in person. I found only chaos and corruption, dead whispers. For a thousand years I was confused, no more. I have gathered the will to return under no name but my own, to champion Wither to Vinter and correct this blighted world. Beg of course he's succeed, a vent. For I have seen the throne of the gods and it was empty. The anchor is permanent. You have spoilt it with your stumbling. So be it. I will begin again. Find another way to give this world the nation and God it requires. I will not suffer even an unknowing rival. You must die. It doesn't end here. You talk long enough. You are an arrogant fool. Your arrogance blinds you. Good to know. If I'm dying, it's not today. Achievement unlocked and your heart shall burn. <sighs> Wait a minute. I just realized this. I was saying I am not. I just realized I was saying I'm not doing this in seventh time, but that was my seventh attempt. <laughs> Lucky number seven. I meant I'm not doing this in eighth time. <sighs> Where am I? Oh shit, am I doing this on my own? Whoa. Well, I have no idea how long this is gonna be in the edit, but I'm gonna do my outro just in case that it has to end here. <laughs> but we're continuing. Ooh, I walk slow. You know, the whole time, I was thinking in my head, like, like, of course I was thinking in my head, where else would I be thinking? This whole time I was thinking, why does he always sprint everywhere? I wish we had a normal walking speed. Be careful what you wish for. Ooh, he's really hurt. You're gonna be okay, Akora Rod. There. Shit. You have gained the Mark of the Rift, a focus-based ability. Mark of the Rift causes massive damage and can even kill some enemies instantly. Focus-based ability focuses a resource that is gained each time someone in your party deals damage. Each party member has a personal focus meter, but all party members can gain focus when a single member deals damage. Okay. Use one to use Mark of the Rift, okay? Uh, that. Holy shit! Those enemies were really tough before. Hmm. Oh, was 
that new thing on my screen? The focus meter? Oh, it's cold. I hate winter. I hate winter and everything about it. I hate the cold. I hate being cold. It is... I don't know. I get really bad seasonal depression. I hate fall and winter a lot. I mean, I tolerate fall for Halloween, but... Yeah, for the most... I just hate the cold. Howling the wind or a creature somewhere nearby? How long is he gonna be wandering through the frickin' snow? Oh, there's a thing over there to examine. Come on. You can make it. Numbers. Recent. Okay. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Move so slow. Uh, be careful what you wish for. definitely a wolf. There's no way that was not a wolf. Come on, he can go a little bit faster than that. There! It's him! Thank the maker! Cassandra? That first voice sounded like Cullen. That second one was definitely Cassandra. you in charge. We need a consensus or we have nothing. Please, we must use reason. Without the infrastructure of the Inquisition, we're hobbled. I can't come from nowhere. She didn't say it could. Enough! This is getting us nowhere. Well, we're agreed on that much. Shh. You need to rest. They've been at it for hours. They have that luxury thanks to you. The enemy could not follow. And with time to doubt, we turn to blame. Infighting may threaten as much as this Corypheus. Where is Corypheus now? Do we know where Corypheus and his forces are? We are not sure where we are. Which may be why, despite the numbers he still commands, there is no sign of him. That, or you are believed dead. Or without Haven, we are thought helpless. Or he girls for another attack. I cannot claim to know the mind of that creature, only his effect on us. I should help. Plan yelling won't help. We can't let him find us. Yelling won't help. The only thing yelling gets us is a headache. Another headache. They know. But our situation, your situation, is complicated. Our leaders struggle because of what we survivors witnessed. We saw our defender stand and fall. And now we have seen him return. The more the enemy is beyond us, the more miraculous your actions appear, and the more our trials seem ordained. That is hard to accept, no? What we have been called to endure. What we perhaps must come to believe. Fanatical belief is to 
Blame, I don't believe. I believe, but is that enough? There's a waste of time. We need more than faith. Investigate. I didn't die and come back. I escaped the avalanche. Barely, perhaps, but I didn't die. Of course. And the dead cannot return from across the veil. But the people know what they saw. Or perhaps what they needed to see. The Maker works both in the moment and in how it is remembered. Can we truly know the heavens are not with us? Shall we believe Corypheus? You saw Corypheus. Holy shit. What do shit. you think of his claims of assaulting the heavens? Scripture says magisters, to winter servants of false old gods, entered the Fade to reach the Golden City, seat of the Maker. His arm For their crime, out. they were cast out as darkspawn. Their hubis is why we suffer blight, and why the Maker turned from us. If such is the claim of this Corypheus, he is a monster beyond imagining. All mankind continues to suffer for that sin. If even a shred of it is true, all the more reason Andraste would choose someone to rise against him. He said the heavens are empty. Corypheus said he found only corruption and emptiness, nothing golden. If he entered that place, it has changed him without and within. The living are not meant to make that journey. Perhaps these are lies he must tell himself, rather than accept that he earned the scorn of the Maker. I know I could not bear such. Fanatical belief is to blame for the weight of time. We need more than faith. Mother Giselle, I just don't see how what I believe matters. Lies or not, Corypheus is a real physical threat. You can't match that with hope alone. Your arm is still glitching. Is your arm broken? It's an EA game, all right. Shadows fall and hope has fled. Still your heart the dawn will come. The night is long and the path and full of terrors. is dark. <laughs> Look to the sky for one day soon. The dawn will come. The shepherd's lost and his home is Keep to the stars, the dawn will come. The night is long, and the path is dark. Look to the sky, for one day soon. The dawn will come. Gonna lie, that started off kind of stupid, but then got really inspirational. <laughs> an army needs more than an enemy, it needs a cause. A word. Mm -hmm. Fire. I haven't seen that yet. A wise woman, worth heeding. Her kind understand the moments that unify a cause. Or fracture it. The orb Corypheus carried, the power he used against you, it is Elven. Corypheus used the orb to open the breach. Unlocking it must have caused the explosion that destroyed the Conclave. I do not yet know how Corypheus survived. Nor am I certain how people will react when they learn of the orb's origin. How do you know this? All right. What is it and how do you know about it? They were foci, 
used to channel ancient magics. I have seen such things in the Fade, old memories of older magic. Corypheus may think it to Vint. His empire's magic was built on the bones of my people. Knowing or not he risks our alliance, I cannot allow it. You're right to be worried. Lost hero won't matter. You're right to be worried. This whole mess is confusing. I can see how elves might be an easy target. History would agree. But there are steps we can take to prevent such a distraction. Fade to white. And it's daytime. By Here attacking we the Inquisition, Corypheus has changed it. Changed you. Mm. Scout to the north. Be their guide. This is very pretty. There is a place that waits for a force to hold it. There is a place where the Inquisition can build, grow. How is that staff not frozen to his hand? Sorry. Plus one new operations available. <laughs> nice. This is meant to be silent or supposed to be music here? Get the audio bug out. They arrive daily from every settlement in the okay. region. Skyhold is becoming a pilgrimage. If word has reached these people, it will have reached the Elder One. We have the walls and numbers to put up a fight here, but this threat is far beyond the war we anticipated. But we now know what allowed you to stand against Corypheus, what drew him to you. He's insane, who cares? It was Andraste's blessing, my effort for the Inquisition, he wanted the anchor. It was Andraste's this blessing. This all began with Andraste's blessing. It was that simple. Yet did her blessing grant you worthiness? Or was it given because you were already worthy? <laughs> Your decisions let us heal the sky. Your determination brought us out of Haven. You are the creature's rival because of what you did. And we know it. All of us. The Inquisition requires a leader. The one who has already been leading it. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. You. I don't want this. I'm honored, but I'm not human. I'm honored. I don't know what to say. Say that you will not make me regret this. If you're not sure, why do it? Because I believe this is what was meant to be. That without you, there would be no Inquisition. What it means for the future, how you lead us, that is entirely up to you. It's 
sorry, he looks so weird with his face clipping through his shirt. Akinari will stand for us all. I'll fight for order, not faith. I'll do it because it's right. I'll do it for my own power. Corypheus must be stopped. I'll do it because it's right. This isn't about a greater message. We have an enemy, and we have to stand together. We'll do what is right. The Inquisition will fight for all of us. Wherever you lead us. Have our people been told? They have. And soon, the work. Commander, will they follow? Inquisition, will you follow? <laughs> will you fight? <laughs> will we triumph? <laughs> your leader, your herald, your Inquisitor! <laughs> yeah! Woo! <laughs> I sense a montage. This is montage music. Oh. So this it's is gone. where it begins. It began in the courtyard. This is where we turned that promise into action. But what do we do? We know nothing about this Corypheus except that he wanted your mark. Um, investigate. Is he allied with Tevinter? Corypheus wants to restore Tevinter. Is this a prelude to war with the Imperium? I get the feeling we're dealing with extremists, not the vanguard of a true invasion. Tevinter is not the Imperium of a thousand years ago. Uh-oh. Shit, shit, shit. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no! Oh no! I ran out of disk space! Oh no! One, one moment. I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> oh no. Okay, sorry about that. My computer ran out of disk space and, you know, cut off the thing. <laughs> so, thing. I had to copy and be... I had to, like, back up and delete some files. Very sorry about that. Um... Uh, can he really become a god? Corypheus said he wanted to enter the Black City, but this would make him a god. He is willing to tear this world apart to reach the next. It won't matter if he's wrong. What if he's not wrong? If he finds some other way into the Fade? Then he gains the power he seeks, or unleashes catastrophe on us all. Is his dragon an archdemon? Could his dragon really be an archdemon? What would that mean? It would mean the beginning of another blight. We've seen no darkspawn other than Corypheus himself. Perhaps it's not an archdemon at all, but something different? Whatever it is, it's dangerous. Commanding such a creature gives Corypheus an advantage we can't ignore. Are we safe here? We need more information. Just find me a target. We need more information. Someone out there must know something about Corypheus. Unless they saw him on the field, most will not believe he even exists. We do have one advantage. We know what Corypheus intends to do next. In that strange future you experienced, Empress Selene had been assassinated. Imagine the chaos her death would cause. With his army. An army he'll bolster with a massive force of demons, or so the future tells us. Corypheus could conquer the entire south of Thedas, god or no god. Oh, fuck <sighs> off with you. Go me. away. One who can help with that. Uh, everyone acting all inspirational jogged my memory, so I, I sent a message to an old friend. He's crossed paths with Corypheus before and may know more about what he's doing. He can help. Introduce us. Don't make deals for me. This better be good. Introduce us. I'm always looking for new allies. Introduce me. Uh, parading around might cause a fuss. It's better for you to meet privately on the battlements. Trust me. It's complicated. Okay. Well, then. 
We stand ready to move on both of these concerns. His on hands your order, are enormous. I know one thing. If Varek has brought who I think he has, Cassandra is going to kill him. Who? <sighs> What's about to happen? Okay, I'm definitely ending this video here. <laughs> okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a fantastic day. Be gay. Do crime. I love you. Bye.